Hello everyone! Today, I'm taking you to a complete walkthrough at Sheraton Waikiki Resort on the island of Oahu, Hawaii. This resort is situated in the center of Waikiki, the heartbeat of excitement and entertainment, and also just 3 miles away from the famous Diamond Head Crater. It's an oceanfront resort built in 1971 with 32 floors and features over 1,600 renovated rooms and 131 suites. So come along with us guys and let's check the common areas. So this is the main entrance where the valet parking is and your arrival area if you're taking Uber or taxi. The foyer is very impressive and at the center is a sculpture of Hawaiian sea turtles and they called it Hano. For them, the turtles symbolized good fortune, endurance, and long life. And this is nice, the hotel has its own COVID testing center. And there's a ukulele store here. They also offer a ukulele lesson every afternoon. And on the other side is like an art gallery, but it's still closed because it's still early in the morning. Actually, I really prepared to walk early because this area gets busy and really crowded. People are constantly walking here. And in this side is the Martin and uh, MacArthur. Uh, it's just like a Hawaiian jewelry store and they have uh, beautiful paintings here too. And here is the Maxim Jewelry. Actually, they have beautiful displays here, but I'm not really sure about the price. And on the other side is the Hawaiian Clothing Shop. Uh, so if you forgot your Hawaiian dresses and shirts, don't worry because you can buy it from here. And this is the Cookie Corner where you can buy the best cookies in Hawaii. And that's the concierge. And um, actually, uh, behind the concierge is the registration area. And look at this one. Beautiful sun sculpture. It's perfectly done. By the way, if you're booking this hotel, make sure it's Sheraton Waikiki because I did a silly mistake. I booked a Sheraton Ocean View room. I'm unaware that there's another Sheraton here in Waikiki, so it's a little bit confusing. So when we tried to check in, they couldn't find my name. I showed our uh, booking confirmation and it was Sheraton Princess. How sad is that? But anyway, we enjoyed our stay at Sheraton Princess, so just be mindful mindful when booking this hotel and this one is the Lawson station it's a Japanese uh, chain store where you can buy everything also it's just like 7-eleven or ABC here in Hawaii the chapel hats where you can buy good quality and beautiful hats however they're so expensive here the lobby is uh, pretty modern and very spacious the flooring is nice and those are the elevators going up to the tower and this way is heading to the infinity pool and there's another ATM machine here and a coffee corner here the Honolulu coffee And this way is heading to the small beach area.
Pepe's Pizza is also available here but uh, I'm not really sure if they are open because this one is always closed every time we come here and in here is the Kai Market where you can take your breakfast and they have also a buffet dinner so it's kind of nice because uh, you can enjoy the view while eating your dinner and in here is the adult um, swimming pool or the infinity pool and this way is going to the beach area and they have also a bar restaurant here where you can buy your drinks while swimming and uh, this is the one You have to pay everything in here though, unlike in Mexico, it's all inclusive. And uh, look at that view. It's so beautiful. It's so relaxing, especially in the afternoon. You can just sit here and watch the sunset or the surfers. Nice. And now let's go back and check the south side of the resort but before that we're going to walk through to this uh, infinity pool this is the only infinity pool in Waikiki and uh, the longest infinity pool in America that's what they said but I'm not really sure with that because for me it's so small it's still early and look at that it's already packed with uh, people I don't know but probably I'm just comparing to the swimming pools in Mexico. Uh, it's kind of nice though because there's a separate swimming pool for the adults. And this is a great idea. They put some giant planters here. It's just like a barrier so that uh, not everyone can go close to the infinity pool. There are some private and luxury cabanas for rent here and it's nice because all facing to the ocean and this is a pathway going to the other swimming pool and look at the gorgeous view the water is so blue nice and this is the rum fire the best place to watch the sunset while enjoying your cocktail or your appetizer so this is the back of the resort and as you can see there's no beach here but uh, if you walk straight to this pathway it will lead you to the Waikiki beach and what a gorgeous day the sun is out lots of coconut trees and tropical plants and this is the family friendly swimming pool there are lots of lounge chair here and facing to the ocean to the beautiful view It's really nice to walk here and the best thing is this is open to the public so you don't need to be a guest of this hotel they're not checking the wristband and let's check the view here so that's the diamond head crater over there and the Waikiki Beach and there's a seawall built here it's to protect the properties from constantly eroding and if your room is on this side of the hotel, you will get a great view of the Diamond Head Crater and the ocean as well. There are 
lots of fun activities happening here. And if you want to join the pool Zumba, you must book it prior to your arrival. And at night time, there are some beautiful light shows in here too. There's a playground with 70 foot long water slide that the kids can enjoy. The pool is shallow so it's really perfect for the entire family. And there's a pool stand here where you can get your towels and your sunscreen. And by the way, only the guests can use the swimming pools. And one thing that is good in here is the Wi-Fi. It is free and fast. And I really like this area. There's a pond here with giant koi fish. It's a very relaxing to watch them. And back to the lobby, there are two pool tables here that visitors can play and then lounging area, look at the ceiling lamps here, beautiful and it's really open concept that the birds can come in, look at that. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the tour and if you did please don't forget to hit the thumbs up, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mahalo!